So hi, it's great to have you here. Um, we'll start with a very short introduction by Taig Kartfri from UEL, UCL Culture, and then uh, we'll move on to the rest of the program for today. So Taig. Hi everyone, welcome to House of Healing. I'm pretty excited, I hope you guys are too. Uh, today is, it's really interesting um, for me, it's quite an unusual situation for me to be in. Uh, I work at UCL Culture, uh, so our department is charged with um, what we call crossing barriers, breaking borders and opening minds. And the ways we try to do that are by creating conversations, uh, trying to find different ways of facilitating engagement with research, uh, finding different ways of UCL as a university, reaching out to different communities, reaching out to activists, reaching out to artists, and sharing what we do with the world, but also allowing the world to influence what we do as well. And I think a lot of higher education institutes, universities, get a little bit wrapped up in, in their own world and don't really take enough time to speak to other people. So today is a, a conference. Um, it's a, an experiment, it's an exploration, um, and it's a chance for us to all consider different ways of collaborating related to health and well-being, related to research and related to art. And I'm quite excited that we have been given an opportunity to just experiment, to just chat, to, to think about different ways of having conversations. And we have the freedom that um, whatever happens is an interesting thing. And whatever happens is something that's valuable. And so I really encourage everyone, and I'll hopefully be doing it myself today as well, to just open up and have conversations and talk about how we can share things better together and just be free and, and don't worry about anything being perfect or uh, a perfect output coming from anything like this because what's important is the conversation. And what we want to do at UCL is to become closer to others and find better ways to have that conversation in a balanced way. Um, so I hope you can, enjoy, you can join me in that and I hope that we can just have a really interesting, stimulating, free and fun day. Um, so thank you very much, yeah, and maybe George, George would like to uh, explain a little bit more about what we'll actually do today to kind of go towards that aim. So thank you, really looking forward to it. Look, man, you got claps already. <laughs> I hope you will do with us throughout the days, use body, ba body brain bingo hashtag. Um, hopefully, as well as having the conversations, watching performances, participating, meeting new people. We can use as many channels as we can, and we have a new Facebook group and a hashtag just to make more connections, because that's the point of the whole program, today's event, and the work we're doing with UCL and TAIG, is to ask ourselves, what are the ways that we can bring very interesting people with very interesting practices who don't really get a chance to meet each other in a meaningful way as opposed to a sort of a, um, yeah, I have Jaji like going like, like okay, fucking hell, like move on. Uh, so, um, another 10 minutes. Um, so, um, I'll tell the, yeah. So, when I was born. Um, so, back to uh, the very important hashtag. Uh, yeah, if you could uh, engage in, in ways beyond uh, having a chat here, thoughts that you have post the conference, during the conference, and so on, please do. It really helps us um, capture what people are thinking and the questions that we haven't thought about, which, of which there are many, I'm sure. So the day today is gonna go like this. We're gonna have a couple of talks um, in a moment, and the talks are by Deborah Pearson, um, who will be talking about, woohoo! <laughs> We'll be talking about her work uh, as an artist, but also in relationship to um, other collaborations with institutions and other makers. And I will leave the, the interesting talk uh, to Deborah. Followed by Claire Corman over there, who will be talking about her walking practice. And Claire is also a partner in the overall Body Brain Bingo project. So you'll be able to have other experiences with Claire later today. 
Then immediately after those talks, that we'll have also a chance for a Q&A after that, we're going to go for a session all together where you have a chance to discuss questions with people you don't know. That will be followed by lunch. And after lunch, we'll have a couple more short talks, one by ourselves at ZUK, and one by Marie-Louise Plum, who is over there at the back, um, who will be talking about her project, Mental Spaghetti. I'll leave the details to you. And then we have a series of performances and a series of games that have been put together under the theme of mental health and well-being, but all of which have some element of collaboration between academics and artists and or activists in some way. So hopefully the whole day today is about experiencing, testing, participating in, and having conversations about these uh, unusual collaborations and how we can learn more to be better at supporting those collaborations and making those connections. Um, later on, I'll talk more about how the House of Healing fits into Body Brain Bingo as a whole project, which is a year-long project. But I think it's enough information for now. I, I really hope you enjoy the day. And there'll be a moment later today, at around 4.30, where we will have an open mic for you to pitch projects to each other. So we will limit the pitches to 60 seconds, um, for good reasons. Um, but if you have something by the end of the day that you think, oh, I'm really looking for this kind of collaborator, this kind of support, please come up to the stage um, and, and pitch it back to us before we, we have a kind of a more loose conversation and bar. All right, hope it's okay. Uh, looking forward to it. And so, Deborah, would you like to come up? <laughs>